Hello everyone, I am Rajil. Today I am going to teach you about preparation of ethers from alcohols. We can prepare ether from alcohol by using dehydration reaction. By dehydration of alcohols. By dehydration of alcohols. For example, ethanol, CH3, CH2 oils in presence of sulfuric acid at 413 Kelvin. Okay, this temperature is important. 413 Kelvin produce either CH3, CH2, O, CH2. CH3 plus H2O. I will show you a simple trick to make the product. Okay, ethanol. Okay, two molecules of ethanol is reacting with the sulfuric acid. Okay, so draw two ethanol molecules. H O CH2. CH3, ethanol 1, ethanol 2. In the presence of sulfuric acid, what is the role of sulfuric acid? Sulfuric acid act as a act as a dehydrating agent. What is by dehydrating agent? The chemical substance which help removal of water is called dehydrating agent. Okay, that is sulfuric acid help. Sulfuric acid help to remove water from two molecules of ethanol. Clear? Sulfuric acid will help to remove water from ethanol. Okay, so in the presence of sulfuric acid, at 413 Kelvin undergo dehydration. What is by dehydration? Removal of water. Okay, so sulfuric acid remove water from two molecules of ethanol like this HOH. Okay, this is only a shortcut. Actual mechanism I will explain after this. Okay, H2O. So what is remaining? CH3, CH2, then O, HOH. Okay, H. OH water O then CH2 CH3 what is byproduct plus water okay sulfuric acid help to remove water from two molecules of ethanol okay here water is removed and what is the main product ether why this compound is called ether because here the functional group is O. What is the name of this compound? What is the name? Edoxy. Edoxy. Edane. Edoxy. Edane is the IUPAC name of this ether. Mechanism of dehydration of alcohol to ether. This mechanism involves mainly three steps. Okay. First of all, we can write the main reaction. CH3, CH2, OH, two molecules of ethanol in the presence of sulfuric acid at 413 Kelvin undergo dehydration and form either CH3, CH2, O, CH2, CH3 plus by product is water. Okay, and the final product is either edoxy ethane. Here the temperature 413 Kelvin is very important because at 433 Kelvin, 433 Kelvin, same reactant and sulfuric acid form alkene instead of ether. At 433 Kelvin. Ethanol undergo dehydration in the presence of sulfuric acid 
form edine okay alkene will be the product so the temperature is important don't write 433 the product will be different so write 413 413 kelvin okay then already i said mechanism the real path of this reaction involved mainly three steps step 1 in first step involved formation of protonated alcohol from ethanol i will show you the reaction ch3 ch2 oh ethanol then h plus h plus from sulfuric acid h plus from sulfuric acid okay h2so4 h2so4 dissociate to form h plus plus so4 minus 2 okay so this h plus i wrote here clear sulfuric acid dissociate to form h plus and so4 minus 2 and this h plus h plus from sulfuric acid will react with the first ethanol molecule form protonated alcohol okay in the presence of concentrated sulfuric acid ethanol will act as a base okay in the presence of a strong acid ethanol behave like a base base can accept proton clear base will accept proton so what will form ch3 ch2 o then two electron no change here you can see two electrons okay this two electrons makes a bond with h h is from proton okay h from proton then from a bond then already one h is present here okay so by using this two electron h plus makes a bond then now count number of electron around oxygen 1 2 3 4 we know oxygen is atomic number 8 electronic configuration is 2,6 8 proton 8 electrons but see here how many electron how many valence electron 2, 1 2 3 4 5 that is eight protons but seven electrons so one proton is excess clear so oxygen form a positive charge okay a positive charge will develop on oxygen for balancing the loss of electron okay and this product this intermediate product is called protonated protonated alcohol in step 2 step 2 protonated alcohol will react with another ethanol molecule form another intermediate okay listen here protonated alcohol ch3 ch2 o then h here on positive charge h okay this is protonated alcohol formed in the first step it will react with the second ethanol molecule because beginning i wrote do you remember beginning i wrote two ethanol okay one ethanol already reacted and this protonated alcohol will react with the second ethanol second ethanol molecule ch3 ch2 oh okay not this one this is ethanol one this is ethanol two remaining ethanol ethanol two then form an another intermediate i will show you the formation of intermediate electron present here will shift it to oxygen okay because the compound is unstable due to the positive charge so for getting stability this two electrons will shift it to the oxygen okay after shifting what will happen here after shifting oxygen will get this two electron and form water 
Okay, like this. O X X then two electrons here, already two electrons are here, then two electrons shifted, the two electrons can represent here. What is this H O H two lone pair? Can you tell the name of this compound? Yes, this compound is water. Okay, then after shifting this two electron, what about the charge of this carbon? After shifting this two electron to oxygen, then this carbon will acquire a positive charge. Okay, due to the shifting of this electron to oxygen, carbon acquire a positive charge and form CH3, CH2. Then this plus will make a bond with the OH. Will make a bond with the electron present on O. Okay, and product is this CH3, CH2. Then water already removed. This plus will attach on this oxygen. O then two lone pair. Then CH2, CH3, CH2, CH3. Okay. Plus make a bond with the electrons present on oxygen. Okay. Then CH2, CH3. Then already one H is present here. Okay. That H we can represent here. Okay. H. This H. Okay. In this product. Check number of electrons around oxygen. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, so we can write one positive charge on this intermediate. So this is the intermediate formed in step 2. Now, see step 3. In step 3, this intermediate CH3, CH2, O X plus CH2 CH3 lost the proton this lost the proton okay this two electron will shift it to the positive charge and form CH3 CH2 O one non pair this two electron will shift it to oxygen okay and one lone pair again then ch2 ch3 then after shifting this electron h become proton h plus so this is our final product the final product is either ch3 ch2 o ch2 ch3 ch3 ch2 o ch2 ch3 okay and what is the role of sulfuric acid removal of water Second step, water removed. And the final step, H2SO4, sulfuric acid, in the form H plus will remove from the compound. This is about the mechanism of dehydration of alcohol to ether. Clear?